do subscribe to ekeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello friends in the last lecture we have studied that the temperature is also dependent on the rate of reaction if the temperature increases then the rate constant can also be increased and because of which the rate of the reaction can also be increased so let us see based on this arrhenius equation that how factors are dependent on the rate of reaction that is temperature let us see so as mentioned on your screen there is a graph which denotes the fraction of molecule with a particular kinetic energy and this is the graph for kinetic energy or this is the axis where kinetic energy is being represented but among that kinetic energy one there will be a part where the energy is known as uh, as present on the screen there is a graph which mentions the fraction of molecules with a particular kinetic energy and a kinetic energy graph so therefore in this case as you can see ea which represents energy of activation is the minimum kinetic energy that should possessed by a reacting molecules so as to convert into a product suppose in this case i am taking this reactions in two condition that is in temperature t1 and in temperature t2 and in this case the temperature t2 is greater than the temperature t1 so let us see that in those colliding molecules or among that colliding molecules which one at what temperature will have the maximum rate of reaction or how many molecules can participate in that temperature so as to give a product so as you can see this temperature t1 the whole graph of temperature t1 it will give you a product while the temperature t2 will also give you a product and the area of the both the curves are being same but if the temperature is greater of t2 and as you can see there are more number of fraction of molecules of reacting mixture that crosses the energy of activation as you can see this area that is the fraction of molecules are greater in this space where the temperature t2 is present which is higher than the t1 when it comes to the temperature t2 it will give product that is for sure but the thing is the area which covers the energy of activation with the help of the temperature t1 is very much less compared to the area which is of t2 so because of this as we can see the number of fraction of the molecules of higher temperature reactants are easily converted into product and that could possess a energy of activation so more the number of products or more the number of products will be formed if the more the number of reactants will possess a particular kinetic energy and this is only possible if we increase the temperature so more the temperature more will be the collision and more will be the collision means more will be the kinetic energy more amount of the reactant molecules will possess kinetic energy and hence we could get a product so this is was the main and a simple example that we have represented that how temperature being a factor in the rate of reaction so thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have got an idea that how temperature can affect the rate of reaction so thank you for watching this video and please share this video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe egeda channel thank you so much